Um, I've been here 29 years now, um, 29th Archie, and um, this is 21 years of packing and prize. I'm Anne Flanagan, an acting director, and I uh, welcome all the media. What a great rollout today. 91st Archibald Prize, uh, a great rollout this year. There were 839 entries uh, and 41 chosen by the trustees. But today is Stevie's day. It's the Packing Room Prize announcement. As everybody knows, Steve holds the 51% of the vote um, <laughs> and continues to do so. But of course, we're indebted to all the staff, all those packers, all those in-store crews uh, that have been dealing with over uh, 2,276 entries this year across all three prizes. To Steve Peters, the packing room for his announcement of the prize. Yeah, I'd like to thank the, um, the fellow packers as well. We're pleased to announce that the uh, winner of the packing room prize this year is uh, for Railing Sharp of a portrait of John Wood. It's been a uh, goal of mine to be uh, on the walls with, um, in this prestige exhibition amongst all of these wonderful painters. Has, um, it's just mind-boggling. And to think that you and your team chose uh, my painting as um, your favourite, I just can't Thank you enough. It's just I like fantastic. It. We liked it, yeah. <laughs> Thanks very much. Well, well, I might say something. I think it's just w wonderful that a relatively unknown painter painting a portrait of a has-been has, -been, has uh, <laughs> managed to win such a prestigious prize. So congratulations, Thanks, Keith. I think you really do need to, to know that person. You know, you, you, you can't just paint, you know, only being introduced to somebody in a, for a short time. You really do need to get to know. So it's a process of getting to know the person um, um, before you actually put any paint on the canvas. So John and I had a few sessions where I'd sit and talk to him and do some charcoal sketching and we just got to know each other, had a few coffees and things like that. And then the process of continually coming to my studio we got to know one another really well and that way I felt I could really depict him, you know, that little bit of something that needs to come through. I wasn't really aware that I was going to be portrayed from that angle in, in a sense, you know. I didn't it's... let him see the painting at all during the process so he, wouldn't, he didn't know what it was going to look like. No. So I was quite surprised mm. by it, mm. you know. Um, and I was surprised at the size of, you know, <laughs> like I didn't expect it to take up so much of the well, the frame. I think portraiture is held as that pinnacle. Um, people think if you can get a good likeness or if you can do a good portrait, then you must be a good artist. 